hi lovely people welcome back to my tutorial for today thank you so much for stopping by thank you for your love thank you for everything and please if this is your first time stopping by kindly help us by hitting on that red icon to subscribe and also touch the notification bell so let all to be the first to be notified whenever i upload a new video so now today's class we shall be looking at how to make a very free a-line gown okay all right so here i'll be cutting the shoulder and the sleeve together so first thing is to fold our fabric into four equal parts then the shoulder i'm working with is 16 inches plus my sleeve i'm using a sleeve of 8 inches each making it 16 so 16 plus the 16 shoulder will give us 32 inches okay or you can just as usual take your round measurement from the sleeve you take it round from the sleeve this way where whichever place you want your sleeve to start from from here from here whichever just go round take your tape round across your shoulder down to the other sleeve all right or you can just add up together okay so what we have is 32 inches so divide by two to give us 16 okay so here i will mark my 16 inches okay now add extra one inch making it 17 for our folding okay so at this place now i will mark the neck that I want to use for this dress is a straight line neck. Okay. All right. So the neck I'm working with because I want it to fall at one side of the sleeve. Okay. I want it to fall at one shoulder. So I'll be using seven inches. Okay. All right. So from my shoulder to my half length, like 17 inches. Okay. So my waist line from my waistline to my hip line is nine inches. So I'll be using this full dress. You no, know, this is by sixty. So I'll be using the full length for this dress. Okay. And I'll also mark my nipple point my nipple measurement so from my shoulder to my nipple is 12 inches which is here and just make a straight line to connect it Okay, I'm making I'm making use of two yards of um, two yards of fabric. Okay, all right. For those that we ask, how many yards do you use? Okay, so this is two yards. Okay. So the next thing I will do is to come down here by one inch. Okay, from the seventeen, I will come down by one inch. So from this one inch now, I will connect my shoulder slope. I will connect it to meet the seven inches. Okay. Okay. So for my armhole, making use of nine inches which is here okay okay here i will take my bust measurement and the bust and i'm the bust i'm working with is 49 inches plus my allowance okay i added eight inches allowance to it so divided by four to give us 12.25 okay 
12.25. So I'll mark my 12.25. So here I'll just add one inch for our seam allowance. Okay, so because this is a free dress, I will just connect. I will just connect it straight to my hemline. Okay, I won't be adding our, I won't be taking our waist measurements and our hip measurements. Okay, I will just, I won't be taking the waist measurements and the hip measurements. So I will just connect it straight. All right. Okay. So remember that what we have in our bust measurement is 12.25. So coming down to this hemline, I will mark the 12.25. Okay. All right. So because this is an A-line dress, I'll be adding extra inches to make this dress to be free at the down part. Okay. All right. So I'll be adding extra. Okay. Two. I'll be adding two and a half inches. And I'll add extra one inch for our... I'll add extra one inch. Okay. So what I will do now is from the bust now, we will connect it straight down to this point. Okay. All right. Okay. So here from this, our armhole now, I will just connect it to this bust measurement this way. Okay, so here I'll we'll just connect it straight down to the hem line. So just connect it straight down. Okay, so I'll just go ahead now and cut it out. Uh -huh. Okay, so I'm through with the cutting, okay, and I've also cut out the neckline. So what I will do now is to go to my machine, okay. Here I will notch those 7 inches, okay, so that I will know where I will stop my stitch. Okay, alright. So from here, I will stitch from here now to this point, okay. So here we serve as my neck line. All right. So after that, I will join this the back and the front shoulder. Then I will use my bayats or the fabric to tape the neck line. All right. So now we use one inch to join my bodies together. And I will also close up the hem line. All right. Okay. So I'll just go to the machine now and do it. And I will come back and show you.